thinking about Cheaper by the Dozen 2 was way better than Cheaper by the Dozen 1. I'm just kidding. We can go change if we want, but it doesn't, no, this does, fine. does it matter what we're no, wearing? Not really. That's what we're eating. Hey guys, welcome back to Allie Can Cook featuring Mama McManus. Hi, I'm Mama McManus. And I'm Allie, and on today's episode of Allie Can Cook, we are going to be showing you guys how we make our pulled pork vegan tacos. Pork is in quotation marks. Not really pork. It's not really pork. Well, we're going to be using spaghetti squash to make our pork filling. If you guys want to see how to make these super easy and delicious tacos, keep watching. So the first thing that you need to do is Preheat your oven to 375 degrees. Okay, so to get started, I'm going to put tablespoon of olive oil into each squash. I'm going to use some taco seasoning and make sure that you get organic taco seasoning and that you don't have any bad chemicals. This is all natural. I'm going to put a half a teaspoon of the taco seasoning in here. Just going to spread it around. Put a half a teaspoon of salt in each squash. this and then I'm just going to put some pepper and eyeball it so now we're going to bake the squash at 375 for about 45 minutes As your squash is cooking in the oven for 45 minutes, you're just going to want to prep everything else that you're going to be putting into these pulled pork tacos. So for our tacos, we are going to be using green and red pepper as well as a red onion and slicing these up, sauteing them in some olive oil. So I just cut up about half of a red onion here, slicing it vertically, and then I'm going to do the same for our green pepper. cook these for about five minutes or so because I still want them to have a crunch when we eat them. We're also going to be making a little vegan garlic aioli to go on top of our pulled pork tacos. So what you're going to want to do is just take any vegan mayo that you have, about one third of a cup. So after you put in one third cup of vegan mayo, you're going to want to use one clove of garlic and just give it a good squeeze. Give it a good squeeze and crush it into the bowl. Squeeze a little bit of lemon, about maybe a teaspoon. And then mix it up, and then we'll just try a little taste. Hmm. Need some salt. Maybe a little bit more lemon. And then we're going to do a little bit of pepper, just a bit, and a little pinch of salt. And then over the shoulder for good. Going to be the aioli that we put over the tacos instead of using a sour cream. But you can use sour cream if you're not into aioli. Mm, that's really nice. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Hot, we've just taken them out of the oven. So what you want to do is take the pan that you just cooked your vegetables in. It should still be warm. We're going to take a fork and shred the squash so it makes a pulled porky type of texture. Add it into our pan. Just be careful because they are hot. You just kind of want to flip it over. Ooh. Oh, they look beautiful on the inside. Start to pull the squash. So it makes like a pulled porky type of texture. So we're going to add this into our pan now. Now we're going to do this one, same thing. Same idea. Don't burn yourself. I'm not going to burn myself, don't worry. Not this worry. So once you've got the majority of the squash, you have to season it to have a barbecue-like flavor. So mom, how are we going to season it today? Well, how we're going to season it today is pretty simple. We're going to use a half a teaspoon of garlic powder. Sprinkle it around. We use a half a teaspoon of cumin. 
Yeah. I love the smell of cumin. I know, it's really nice. Then a teaspoon of the taco seasoning that we used originally. Then we're gonna add in a quarter cup of barbecue sauce and the juice of half of a lime. We're just going to mix that up in the pan here. So after you have this all mixed up, you're ready to assemble your tacos. Alrighty guys, so that is how you make our vegan pulled pork tacos. We made three here, but the batch of spaghetti squash and vegetables we had would probably make about six, about six. six of them. Yeah, about six. Yeah. So we're gonna dig into it now. I'm excited. I'm excited too. And I really like pulled pork, so. <laughs> Here we go. Wow. Mm -hmm. like pulled pork. The barbecue sauce and stuff? The spaghetti squash has the texture of the pulled pork. Mm -hmm. and, but you don't taste any other flavors. Like I know jackfruit sometimes can taste sweet, but this is really good. Oh, I love it. Lots of really good flavors in here. And I definitely would recommend doing this with a hard shell taco just because the spaghetti squash is a little bit softer, but with that extra crunch, oh, oh so, good. so good. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe. We make new videos every single Thursday, and we will see you guys next week. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.